In a world where Wi-Fi is the first thing we ask for, I traded 5G for Big 5. In a 5-day safari in Serengeti. It was an amazing experience, which I'll be sharing with you when I get a thousand views on this video. After my 5-day safari, I decided to visit the Hunters and Gadras tribe, popularly known as Adzabi, who still live like they did 50,000 years ago. From Arusha, I headed to Lake Eyasi Lodge, which happens to be the closest hotel to Adzabi I could find at night. So, we just arrived at, uh, what's the name of this place? Lake, Lake Ayers. Lake Ayers Safari Lodge is the gateway to the um to the <laughs> what's their name? Adzabe people. Adzabe people. Yeah. Show them the picture. Yeah. The it's yeah. the gate to the Adzabe people. So these are the people we are going to see tomorrow. And this place is actually very nice. Trust me, this place is in Parato. With weariness of the safari still in my bones, but excitement in my heart, I left at the break of dawn. On my way, I stumbled upon a village where donkeys were used to fetch water. In all honesty, I have never seen this before, so I took some pictures and thought to share with you guys. After an hour drive, I got to the first settlement of the nomadic Azabe, a tribe that has defied time. Welcome to my journey into the heart of Tanzania, where the past is very much alive. Um, before I proceed, I'd like to say, um, after this trip, I came down with a very bad flu, and it's really affected my voice. So please manage it in this video. So I just arrived in Atabi at this point, and I was welcomed by a handsome Atabi man. There was something in his eyes, a spark of pride, maybe for his heritage. We did the O, I, hello, how are you? In Hadza, which is their language. Anna. Uh, yeah. What's your name? Akwasa Kalebao. Akwasa Kalebao. That's your name? Yeah. Okay. Stingao. Me? Me, 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 Ademulu. First stop on the tour was a house in a baobab tree, like a literal tree. I was so surprised to see this. After inspecting the baobab, it was time to see more of the Hadzabe HQ. I followed my guide who seemed to know everywhere here. Each spot we eat was cooler than the last. It was like a live action Discovery Channel show. Uh, their name, if you want to know their name, so yeah. they can ask. Nyambulu. His name is Nyambulu. Nyambulu. Nice to meet you. And uh, Aleba. Nyangido. Nyangido. Akanabe Nyangido. Nyangido. Yeah. Pirisine. Pirisine. Yangida. Gangida. Yeah. What's his name? His name is Ong Ah. Ong Ah. Ong Ah. Ong Ah. Yeah. 
game is going mad. Mm-hmm. 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 He's going mm-hmm. 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 during mm-hmm. when their father they killing baboon. Baboon. Oh, but Nonga mm-hmm. means baboon. Yes. Oh. Okay. Okay. What does it mean? Bawa is a man. Okay. And when they say Bawa, and you can reply for him Bawa. Bawa. Bawa, 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 Bawa. Bawa, 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 Te hazate zata tichik ombate kuwa ketete wata kuyoba hazane tiki bichi no ta hama ota ase ase hama na ota usepa ota kwaka o kwaka o neta bichi langa semena kwe ishi kwa ota shana ota chivo chua yasane ota chale chale chua tumbate ota chale chale ota chia ulube ota ishi kwa ishi kwa yeah, so what did you say? What's the meaning of what you said? They say they are smoking, go hunting to find some animal what? for eating. Yeah. Yeah. They are living in the bushes. Okay, okay. Yeah. Okay. So the government is elected the way they want to live. Yeah. But normally they're watching the population. Okay. In 2010, they discovered the population had decreased. Yeah. There are some they call Hadzabe Community Project. Yeah. And that's non-governmental project. They deal with the health care, yeah. food and education. Since 2010 up to now, those people, they get 100% about the health care. And also the project, they provide the food for them. Because nowadays, there is a less of animal in the world. Yeah. And secondly, there are other people, pasture people, they are grazing the cattle in the bushes. So the animal, they go far away because of aggressive of the animal. Yeah. That's why the project, they provide the food for them. Okay. Like the money you pay, yeah. half of their money, they enter to the project. About education, still up to now, there is a lot of challenge. Okay. And the Hadzabe, normally they go hunting early morning and yeah. evening. Yeah. And they're using bow and arrow for the hunting. Yeah. And those people, they are eating everything except snake and hyena. They don't eat snake. So they eat lion? Everything wow. except snake and hyena. Why don't they eat hyena? They don't eat snake because of their culture. But okay. some kinds of snake like a python. Yeah. When they see the python, python, they kill. After killing, they're skinning. They took fat from the python. That's fat they're boiling. is a good medicine for the treat asthma. Okay. And they not eat hyena because generation of those people normally they not buried when somebody they die. When somebody they die, they took the dead body, they put in close the bushes or in the rocks. Yeah. And they believing hyena they going to eat that dead body according to the ancestors. That's why they don't eat hyena. And the Hadzabe tribe. So since 2010 up to now, the population they start to go up. Yeah. And Hadzabe tribe. They so they are, the population currently is going up? Yeah, they are already it's going up. up. Yeah. Okay. And Hadzabe, uh, those people, normally they are living in a group. This is one group. They are living more than mm-hmm. 10 families mm-hmm. together. Okay. And they are living scattered. This is one group. When you go 20 kilometers, you can find another group like this one. Where they are, are their women? They are living scattered according... Scattered along like a Yeah, like and I mean... In tra- yeah, I've seen no Hadzabe woman. In tradition of Hadzabe tribe, yeah. during the day when they when they wake up, yeah. the men they live separated with the woman. Ooh. But night, who have a wife, they are sleeping together, together with their wife. And this tribe are monogamy. They are married only one wife. Okay. And Hadzabe tribe, they are speaking Hazane language. Okay. Hazane language is the language. If you hear, it, there is a click in. Yeah. Ali, Mm-hmm. So their language are not a fluently click, mm-hmm. like a bushman for South Kalahari Desert. Yeah. There is a words and a click. Smoke. Uh, they get for the people who are in the cattle in the bushes. Oh, wow. <laughs> but is weed legal? For them, it's not uh, illegal. Okay. They know that is the tradition. <laughs> okay. So, so they're going to explain the types of arrow okay. which they are going to use for hunting. Okay. So we can listen. Ali, 
Hamana Hamana Akanabe Hazane Kaama Ota Udunduako. In Hazabe that's our they call Udunduako. Amo Udundu Akanabe ma Udundu ko kwa shina cheke ma udundu ko ta kobo kobo shana ko in anga on usepa elalo for bird. In 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 ko kwa kwa so apo po 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 po. Maeda That's the babet. Apple is a pigeon. Tutu. Tutu is a dove. Bitch, you take a tattoo. Jelly, jelly. Jelly, jelly is a puppet. Jelly, jelly is a puppet. This is a woodpecker. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Hamana. Hamana Akanabe has a neck. Ama Ota. He. Does they call he lack? Am I collecting cattle or a cobo or cha cha? They use it for hunting bush baby, Sinde. squirrel, abaco, rocco hyrax, zoo, mongoose. I don't know. I mean, no, okay, got the cuckoo up. See, 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 go, 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 but that's not a chew on it. I collect on this lack. Does they call ole ako? Ole ako, kaboneta ota kalimu okomina kwe gewe dako? That they hunting this animal digi digi? Go your god? All media. Hamana. Hama akanabe hazane kama ota kasama. Kasama. Kasama kaboneta ota kalimu akasumina kwe. They hunting the medium animal. Aha, that's pumba. Hmm. What's the name of the animal? Neeko is a baboon. Okay. Shukuji? Shukuji. Quatre de Bava, Bata, Adanico Zanene Ali Hamana Akanabe, Hazane, Adania, Cheba, Zane Piamana, yet Adanico Bava, Bami, or take her boat, take a damn work of tin, she a kayako, or Concolo, or Dully Dully, work of no matter. What's that? This is a poison arrow. Okay. Going to 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 stop the heart. Amak hatete otak kabo kalimu akasu. Bawa kalimu akasu. The big animal. Popo po. Ana zenga u kumati nakoma. Nakoma is a buffalo. Dongoko. Dongoko is a zebra. That is a tendon okay. for the muscles of the animal. If you don't touch it, you will be able to touch it. You will be able to touch it. You will be able to touch it. So I was under the bull by my Adzabi friend by name Bungla. I was ready to channel my inner acha, but spoiler alert, instead of eating the target, I just eat my ego. Use the energy. That should have to be straight. Just these hands. Like this? This hand should have to be straight. And then it will pull up to the eyes. To the ears. Look at Baba. Okay. 
So at this point, my Hadzabi friends decided to show me how they make fire from rubbing wood together. What's this made of? This is soft wood and what of hard wood. Then this? Down, that is the pieces of wood. Pieces of uh, fruits of uh, of uh, what kind of wood is it? Yeah, Ali Zani. Yeah, Zani Kachabi. Ah, 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 Zani, 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 Lami, Zani, Zani. This is a hard wood. Yeah, they use it for making the fire. Zani, Pameko, but Zani Pameko, and this is a soft wood. Okay. So they are do yeah, friction yeah. Uh, and then what was this? Then he, then he eat it like about, this is a pieces of uh, fruits of uh, uh, bags of the fruits of a baobab. Okay. So they're using so when they, they do, do friction, friction, they fire they come down here. Okay. And then we will see the fire. Interesting. Okay? Yeah, so wow. and also you can try. I can try? Yeah, why not? Okay. I am. Uh, Sorry. Why it Aliba? This is their clothes which they make from animal skin. So I decided to go on them with the Hadzabi, but on our way on them, I saw a few gems and artifacts which were a match the Hadzabi people sell for money. So now we start hunting and the Adzabi people call their dogs. Apparently they hunt with their dogs. We kept walking in the forest, searching for animals, and what we could find, squirrels, birds. And um, it seems we are about to find something here. I think it's a bird. Yeah. Is it going to shoot the harrow? Oh no, it's flew away. It's trying to shake the canoe that shot. Oh no, the bed flew away. Seems we ran out of luck. So we went searching for other animals, if we could find any. Walking in this bush is very difficult because of the thorns. They keep sticking into your skin, they're like a thorn in your flesh. Sorry? <laughs> uh, this is a tree, I think, she, which they are cutting. Yeah. Uh, it's a tree which they are made the arrow. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, Zabi just found a squirrel and uh, it's very difficult to spot. I must give them this. They have very sharp eyesight. They can spot animals in the bush. But still, again, we're house of luck. 
Today seems to be a very unlucky day. Should I excuse them? No, 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 no. Gone. After about an hour in the forest and we couldn't find anything, we decided to head back to the village. And some of them decided to stop for this berry. This seems to be their favorite, most favorite berry. They love it a lot in their community. So after this, they asked me to shoot arrows with them and see how they do their hearts of shooting. After shooting arrows, the Hadzawi decided to dance for me and asked me to dance with them. I obliged and I really enjoyed their culture. Their dance steps and the music was something to remember. <laughs> Wait, you know how to hold it. Just hold it, don't press anything. No, like, yeah. I want to dance with them. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. 
after a long day getting to know each other, hunting and dancing, I decided to ask the Hatabe just two questions which I've always wanted to ask them. Do they believe in God? And what do they believe happens to them? That they, and okay. they had this to say. Yeah. They believe in hunting. So is that their religion? They don't have a religion. They believe in nature. Okay. Yeah. So they don't believe in life after death or what happens to them after they die? They don't thinking about the about what happens about the about the another life. They don't thinking about that. Okay. So they just focus on this and enjoy it. Get the meat. Okay. To collect the fruits of baobab. Okay. Abanako. Honey. Okay. Shumuko. Shumuko. Fruits. Okay. And some kinds of fruits. Yeah. Like these fruits also. So, I explorers, thanks for watching this video. If you made it this far, please like and subscribe and leave a comment, it matters a lot to me.